Praise the Lord. Greetings in the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Welcome back to Daily One Missionary Biography. Today we are going to learn about Alice Marvel, a female missionary who had come to India to serve the people of India in the name of Jesus Christ. Alice Marvel was born on 26th January 1865 in England. The Sepoy Mutiny of 1857 is a well-known event in the freedom struggle of India. There were hundreds of innocent casualties on both sides. Peshwa Nana Sahib imprisoned hundreds of British women in one big hall called Bibi Ghar in Kanpur, now Kanpur, and mercilessly ordered his sepoys to slaughter them. The British army could only arrive after the massacre and found bodies floating in knee deep blood in that hall. Although the British had their revenge, the Society for Propagation of Gospel in Foreign Parts, or SPG, too wanted to avenge their dead. Hence, they sent Alice Marvel to establish a hospital for women on the same grounds where hundreds of British women were killed. Alice was an enthusiastic Christian since her youth. She did not let her academic pursuits dull her spiritual experiences. With sheer brilliance, she helped her colleagues in their academics and turned them into opportunities to gently share Christ's love. She was always mindful that her academic knowledge is not for herself but for the service of Christ. Hence, after her graduation, she joined SPG to serve as a missionary who then sent her to Congo. Well aware of Congo's situation and the risk she would face for being a British missionary, Alice courageously arrived there in 1899. She established St. Catherine's Hospital to provide medical care for local women. Initially, she was busy building the dispensary and providing medical care to the locals. But soon, the plague descended upon Congo. With the plague, Alice was overwhelmed with patients in the hospital during the day. Yet, she visited door to door in the night, asked to attend women who weren't allowed to come in public. She spent sleepless nights and helped many to recover from the deadly disease. However, her fragile body couldn't take the excessive strain and the plague attacked her too. On 5th January 1904, knowing that it's the end of the road for her, amid great pain, she finished her race with the words, I have been so happy here. Beloved, are you mindful that your knowledge should serve Christ's purposes? Lord, open my eyes to see opportunities to use my talents to spread your love. Amen. May God bless you.